I'm going to be an exfoliated version of myself. Nice and dewy. Yeah. Apparently people do that. Mm. I don't have any clean clothes. Well, they're in my trunk. Mm. Oh, I did bring it in, didn't I? You did, Hannah. Yeah. You did. Nobody come outside right now. I'm having a difficult time deciding if what I'm feeling is nervous or if I'm just flat out fucking terrified. <laughs> Hannah the Mountaineer. <laughs> Gonna like the ring of that. This is two days before I began this whole thing. My current situation is that here on out, I am on my own in the world again. I am working and living on a homestead in the mountains of Northern California. And I'm gonna be here for like two months or something. I just need to remind myself that I'm in complete control. This is gold, you're gonna wanna write this down. And I know, did I move to the mountains? I am in complete control. As a nomad, where I live is where I lay my head for the night. Oh, that feels good. That's the lifestyle, baby. That's, <laughs> you know, it's like we're rock stars on tour except I'm in the mountains. Come on. Two motels, four tanks of gas later, and we are here. How is this the only song I know? <laughs> and I can't even play it. My anxiety, that's gone down a good amount since I got here. Knock on wood for that one. I think it partially has to do with being in nature and being around animals. <laughs> but also just being in one place and being around good people because my hosts are really cool. Oh, that feels good. I'm still sort of adapting though, but I could get used to this. I could used to ow ow this is baby i've been doing some weeding and we have this system oh down where i'll weed and dig and then when i find a worm i'll put it on either my hand or one of my tools and she'll pluck it up pluck it off and we have a little language right? watch this i'm gonna put it here yeah <laughs>
for the past few days I've been putting finish on this. It's almost done, I think, I hope. <laughs> but those have been like my main jobs the past few days is, is painting, sanding, and then doing like garden work. I come on the TV screen wearing pistols and a hat. I'm the number one attraction every supermarket. I've been here about like five days now. Today is a Saturday. And do you know what that means? It means it's my day off. It means... Can you not? It's that sun that you're seeing hitting my face and it's actually radiating not only light, but heat as well. I almost want to like put sunscreen on. Nah. Is that a fucking frog? You know, one time, quick story time. I was in Hawaii with my best friend. She got like a free ticket and she picked me because who wouldn't want to go to Hawaii with all this? <laughs> we were at the grocery store, you know, getting like sunscreen and stuff. We, you know, we, we were 18 and we wanted to get like tan. And so I was like, hey, hey, how about this? This is a good idea. And I picked up the sunscreen and it said SPF 4 on it. A few days later, she and I are uh, in the emergency room. <laughs> yeah, and yup. We had sun poisoning. I was throwing up. She had like bubbles on her face. I was puffy in the face. It was not a good look. <laughs> no, but it, anyways, I'll just lay here for a minute. I think this this place is gonna healthy me out. Healthy me out. I know I know how to speak. I'm eating a lot of lettuce because they grow it, and eggs. Where did I put the eggs? Sun. <laughs> Cover me in sunshine. Juggling contest. Cover me in. Tell me, oh, since the beginning. Today I frolicked in the trees, in the in the bushes, in, not the bushes, yeah, I was actually frolicking in the bushes. Goat's milk, a dash of that. See, I find that the more goats, the more milk that you add, the more eggs you get. Well, not technically. Ugh. Oh, I think it is supposed to be on the other side. Thank you to whoever is out there looking out for me uh, for this amazing meal. Please keep my mom and brother and my dog and even my dad safe and healthy. Continue to gift me with this love of art and travel. Please help those who are less fortunate than I. Um, thank you. <laughs> and um, I guess I'll see you tomorrow. Uh, amen. Amen. These are straight from the garden. Oh, no, that's wrong. Oh. Yep, there's a shell. Good going. You're gonna be eating your eggs and learning your geography at the same time. <laughs> South Dakota, North Dakota, Nebraska. Learning these things. Next time on Hannah's Hiatus. Monkey is going into labor. Is it like rude to bring a tripod to a bird thing? <laughs> oh. <sighs> I would know if my knee was out of place, right? I'm so scared. Does that look weird? Oh my god, is my knee out of place right now? No. Okay, Hannah, you're fine. Whew. Okay, it's all in my head. I was about to pass out because I was like, how, what would I do? Like, what would I do in that situation if my knee was literally out of place? Like, hey, so I know you're in the middle of cleaning up a placenta, but my knee's out of place. Can we drive like an hour? <laughs>